Uh, come out with its quarterly numbers. Has it been appetizing? Has it been sour? Let's find out. Vinny here to break down the quarterly earnings and the latest news and updates. Vinny. So yes, in terms of Zomato's numbers, a good set of strong set of numbers that came in from Zomato. That's why we saw the stock also jump up and trade after the numbers were announced. Now revenue and pad above the estimates margins in line with what the street was expecting. So revenue growth overall an 18% revenue growth, uh, profit seeing a growth of almost 45% coming in at 253 crores. That's the profit of the company. Now calculated EBITDA has also seen a marked improvement coming in at 177 crores, which is the calculated EBITDA adjusted debitor that the company reports that's coming at 299 crores versus 9, 194 crores all these numbers are on a sequential basis on a quarter on quarter basis that we are comparing food delivery business a good growth of 10 percent quick commerce 22 percent growth while hyper pure business on a lower base also continues to see a very strong improvement coming in at a growth of around 27 percent adjust the debitor that's also where when you're looking at specifically for the food delivery business uh, that's obviously seen a growth but when you're looking for quick commerce also uh, on that uh, quick commerce EBITDA loss uh, has obviously seen a significant decline coming in. Now its EBITDA loss is only at 3 crores versus a 37 crores last year what we are comparing. In terms of uh, the shareholders letters, a lot of important insights that come in on that front. Food delivery, they said that that remains on track to uh, getting towards that 4 to 5 percent adjusted debitor mark. Quick commerce also is sustaining that adjusted debitor break even. Uh, high pure business, strong growth of 27 percent like I mentioned and blink it. Fingers crossed as everything works out well, the company said that they will be expecting to open 2,000 stores by 2026. For FY25, it's a 1,000 store target. So keeping an eye out on those store openings blink for uh, Blinkit, that's a quick commerce side. Now obviously, district, that's become the buzzword, right? After Zomato posted on its uh, Twitter page and uh, on its social media about district. So district is a new app that they're launching. It's for going out, a one-stop uh, shop for all the going out apps. So whether it's moving movie ticketing, ordering, you know, dine-in bookings that everyone does as well. So that is what District will be focusing on. It's a one-stop shop for all going out purposes and that's what their focus is. A new launch coming in, a new app. District is what we're watching out for. But all in all, a good number from Savato.